This is an instructional video detailing the applications and functions of the Phase 2 PHT-1800 Portable Hardness Tester. The PHT-1800 is designed to test metals, primarily steels, cast iron, aluminum alloys, and copper alloys. The technology incorporated is based on the Lieb system of hardness. A carbide ball is spring-loaded and impacts the workpiece with a given force. The rebound velocity is measured and converted to a hardness value in Lieb, which can be converted automatically and can be read in any number of scales, which is selectable prior to testing. Certain workpiece parameters must be met for the Lieb system to work properly. Mass of the work part is critical. A good rule of thumb is the workpiece needs to have mass equal to a minimum of a half inch thick of solid steel where the test will be applied. Parts with mass a little less can be affixed, if possible, to something of larger mass to obtain performance. Should you have workpieces that are not close to such mass, please contact Phase 2 and inquire about our ultrasonic portable hardness testers. The next parameter is surface roughness. Surface roughness should average a 2 micron or 80 micro inch finish or better using the standard impact probe. Optional probes such as the G probe can handle rougher surfaces such as on rough castings. The Phase 2 portable Lieb hardness testers have available the following probes for various applications. The D probe is a general purpose probe and comes standard on all models. The C probe is a reduced energy probe for case hardened layers. The DL probe has a needle type tip in order to test in tight places such as gear teeth. The DC probe is short to fit in small bores or confined areas. And the D15 probe has a narrow contact area for use in grooves or recessed areas. The G-Probe is designed to test large rough castings. It utilizes a 5mm ball, while all the other probes utilize a 3mm ball. Now let's move over to operation of the hardness tester and see how easy it is to utilize the different functions, taking tests and obtaining results. To begin, insert the plug of the impact device into the correct socket on the tester. On the keypad, hit the power button to bring up your test screen. The main interface screen should be displayed. Each indicator on the screen has a purpose. We will go over in detail the meaning of each and how to make any changes if necessary. Let's begin with material setting. Press the MAT button to preset the material you'll be testing. Continue pressing the material button to scroll through the menu. Stop at the correct number for the material of your choice. Next we go to scale. Pressing the HD button will allow you to toggle through hardness scales of your choice. Please note the scales available are related to the material selected and the probe detected. The backlight key is easy to turn on and off. The DIR key is used to change the direction of the test probe during your test. The count button will allow you to preset how many tests will be taken before an average is computed. The strength button will allow you to toggle between hardness test and, and tensile strength. The save button will allow you to enter the saved values for viewing or exporting.
Taking a test or a series of tests is quite simple once your parameters are all set. Load the impact device just like you would load a pump action shotgun. Place the end of the impact device flat on your workpiece and release the load by depressing the top button. You will see the results shown on screen. You will also notice that the screen is showing your battery life. Direction of probe during test, the material selected, the scale you are reading in, and the number of tests you have taken. The number will revert back to zero once you have reached the number of tests to take an average. At that time, then an average will show on the screen. Taking a series of quick burst tests are rather simple and easy. Installing the DataPro software allows you to move data over to your PC, retrieve, set limits, save, print reports, and even transfer to Excel. Phase 2 tester, PHG 1800 comes with standard with the module, the impact device, a test block, a tip, a wire cleaning brush for the impact device, software, a calibration certificate, and a manual in a plastic molded case. This concludes our application and function guide for the Phase 2 PHG 1800 portable hardness tester. Should you have any questions, Please do not hesitate to contact us at 1-201-933-6300.